Chelsea verdict, Keeper keeps Blues in it with string of top saves, but rest of Tuchel's backups nowhere near good enough. Keeper Arizabalaga staked his claim to be Chelsea's new N01. But some of the Blues fringe players aren't even championship quality. Chelsea actually have two massive heroes to thank tonight for not losing this game, a game they did not deserve to win and were lucky to get the draw. Not only the two-goal striker Timo Werner, but Keeper between the sticks as well. That just about says all you need to know about the game tonight, Chelsea heavily relying on a couple of players to get something out of the game. And if it wasn't for the Spanish keeper Chelsea would have lost this game and actually deserved to. He made three or four world-class saves tonight to keep Chelsea in the game, and this has come at perfect timing with number one stopper Edward Mendy soon to be heading out to the African Cup of Nations. If Keeper keeps these performances up, he might feel like he can stake a claim for the number one spot in Mendy's absence, but you know Mendy has been absolutely world-class for Chelsea since joining, all bar his last game. Free bets, get over £2,000 in new customer deals other than that, Werner was great for Chelsea. When those around him were folding and being rolled over by Zenit, he decided enough was enough and grabbed the bull by the horns to score Chelsea's first goal, set up Lukaku for the second, and then make and score the third himself. When others around him lacked mentality and passion, the German stepped up right when Chelsea needed him to. The final point to make, though, is that a few of these Chelsea fringe players are struggling to even show championship quality right now let alone Premier League quality. And it makes me wonder whether Chelsea's strength and depth is actually as good as many believed it to be, myself included. One half read our football news live blog for the very latest rumors, gossip and done deals Ross Barkley got a bit better in the second half, but he was atrocious in the first half. Malangsar is not much more than just an average defender, and Saul Niggas despite even being tried in another position at wing back, was just as poor as he has been all season. None of them are proving to be good enough to